I want to run because I'm kind of excited. We are getting our UTV today, our Honda UTV. It's pretty fancy. <laughs> I don't usually get excited about a vehicle and I really don't even drive. I've never even owned a car. So this will be kind of fun. I may even actually drive this around the property. It looks that cool, but it's not just cool. It's going to be very, very useful on this property. We need a little bit of a workhorse machine. I almost like slipped right there. <laughs> that would have been too, too much. Anyway, we're going to see it and I'm not going to run because I, I fear that I'm going to land on my ass. <laughs> That's it. How did it all go? Went fine. You got all the parts and everything? Yeah, that's what took longest. And then, uh, yeah. It's bad. Your windshield, two others came in. They didn't include any hardware. The manufacturer just forgot to put the hardware in it. Oh, boy. So that was a... It was a fight getting with them. We had enough spares that we were able to kind of do it. But yeah. Now we're Okay, so <laughs> let's recap because I mentioned that we got the UTV just kind of at the, the right time, the nick of time, but that's not entirely true. We had just missed a huge snow. Uh, snow came in, it was about two feet, I would say. It was like past Saunders' knees. Uh, he was sending me pictures of it, it was insane. South of us, they got 40 inches and we talked to our neighbors and they're like, we haven't seen this kind of snow in like 27 years. So I'm kind of glad we're here to experience like a really bad snow just to get the full range of what could happen here. But anyway, we didn't have the UTV at the time. I don't even know if it would have been helpful because how can anything kind of plow 22 inches of snow? So we only had to shovel. I wasn't here, I said we, but only Sondra had a shovel and he started to shovel out, God bless his soul. <laughs> and it was taking forever and he's like, I can't do this. So we had to hire somebody to plow but the reality is 
everyone was snowed in and it was really hard to find somebody to plow out. And who's gonna plow out? It was like, it was, it's how, how are you gonna get out of that? So we ended up hiring an excavator. <laughs> A guy came and excavated the driveway out. Ever since then, we got the UTV and it's been great. Sandra's been using it like every single day now for the winter. You know, we're gonna be using it in the summer too. So I think it's been very useful for us. And, you know, ever since that 22 inches, we've just been getting snow after snow after snow. And uh, yeah, so it's been great. That's it. <laughs> now I'm gonna feed some of these uh, deer. Okay, so we just got back, we missed another snowstorm, but when we miss a snowstorm, that means that our driveway suffers and we need to use the UTV now. We can't get really up the driveway. I mean, we could try with the car, but I don't want to risk it. So Sonder went up to get the UTV and he's going to clear out the driveway just in time for another snowstorm, believe it or not. So we're getting about a one inch every hour. So we'll have another 10 inches and it's gonna get really cold and we might get freezing rain later. <laughs> so this UTV has really come in handy for us. It really has. I, I think we just got it just in time. It's all ice. Oh man. It's unreal. But it's still quite loose in the ground. So yeah. I'm well, go back up and come back down. Yeah, yeah, do that. Cause we don't want to compact that. We'll probably throw salt and cinders later. Oh boy. Okay, we just got a snow squall coming through. <laughs> Another one. It's just like this line on the map that just keeps on going and going and we're like right in the middle of that snow squall. And I saw the deer up here and they're looking for food. So I'm gonna go down and uh, feed them a little bit closer to the road because I do feel bad for them. It's just been constant snow and I'm sure they're all hungry. They have hunger pains. And Sonder went out and is using the UTV again to guess what? Plow snow. <laughs> That's pretty much all that we've been doing for the last um, couple months here. <laughs>